copyrighted at this point, I think. Um, here we go. Okay, knees versus Rika. Game number one. All right, we're going to see uh, which of these Mordexes is going to come out on top here. Nice has got the animated gauntlets, so I'm going to give him favor there, right? They're like... I mean, your, your drip is 25% of your, your skill. Gold, black, and red rather than just, you know, the classic black yeah. Mordex. It does look good on Demon Island, though. Ooh, yeah. So far, opening up pretty even here. Gauntlets both sides, falling with down air. Let's see what Rick is able to do. Nice job. Gets the nair, gravity cancel, and like it to get the edge guard. No, knees lands with that down air, tries to chase out Jim, but Rika with the wake up recovery is going to make it dead even in this game number one. Yeah, this first stock is about as close as it gets, Taza. Is he going to find anything? Nope. Rika is going to come up with a side air, get back up on stage, looking for that landing. Caught it and caught the stock. Knees drops. He falls, and Rika has the very small advantage. Yeah, the first thing I'm noticing, because this is like my first time today commentating a Rika set, mm -hmm. is that uh, wh when he's following Nise's landings, he's opting for, for traditional movement. He's not mm. doing the dash landing, dash forward, dash back. He's actually just using his default movement to be able to cover where that landing is and then be able to react to it. Um, we'll see if Rika continues to do that as we go on through the set. Now evened up 2-2 two two as Nise was able to get that stock back right away. And he's continuing. Hold on. There we go. Nice. And it's just like that, I was going to say that, you know, uh, had a little bit of a lead there, but just brought it right back to pretty much equal. Oh, reaching up with the Nair. Can't find anything. Ooh. Oh, Dare. Dare. Yep. Dare in a neutral sig. Cool. And going to finish off right there. Give Knees the lead. R Rika is on his final stock again, number one. There's so many uh, times where I see players just drifting towards the stage and then they get sared. And uh -huh. I'm like, huh, they just weren't, they weren't ready to dodge that. Side side air does reach a little bit further than yeah. it looks, but uh, still. Rika getting that side air. Edge guard. Nice job. Right Catches back. the startup frames of the scythe recovery. See that stuff recovery effects there. Knees goes down and just like that it's even one to one yeah this is a crazy opening game i hope this is uh setting the pace for the rest of the set because if so we are in for an absolute treat these guys are absolutely scrapping on demon island right now miss the dare oh they're just stacked on top of each other whiffing okay <laughs> dare is going to put them back off with the okay. active input wait a all second right. let, him the cook. let him cook he has nothing left let's no. go all the way back to the stage oh. that sair would have been perfect except nice perfectly timed his dodge after getting his head all the way to the edge of the blast zone all that damage coming in coming up from rika still didn't get him the lead that he needs to be able to get this win over knees knees just needs recovery Rika needs so much more you see you see knees looking for it Rika goes for the uh, exhaustion recovery afterwards and lights almost enough to knock out Ooh. here knees goes all the way out unarmed recovery does not hit scythe picked up that might actually be harder to knock out with an unarmed and knees realizes that and he throws the scythe away i'm like yeah just stay unarmed <gasps> kicks him away oh, both no. players are just scrambling for oh, this no. game one victory this is oh knees is it looks panicky, but I promise you, Knees is like in a flow state. What is this finishing? What is the oh. end of this game? There we go with an unarmed recovery from Knees is going to barely get that dub. It's so funny that Scythe is like so bad at knocking out uh -huh. that he was like, no, it was like, it was correct to just, like he picked it up and he's like, what the hell is this? And he throws it down <laughs> on the ground. He just starts spamming unarmed recovery. He was like, I'm not going to go with this. Uh -huh. We're going to see this combo from Rika, I think, catches him with the Nair side light, so nasty, Nair Sair, Nair Sair, and then just barely does knees dodge back, get the reversal. Um, yeah, and then he gets the unarmed recovery there at the top. What are they doing? I don't know. They got you on the, on the screen back there. That's very large. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> don't worry about it, chat. We're going into game number two. Knees with a game on the board. Going into this game, we're going to continue with the... Oh, wait. Rick is like... Rick is... Drip has like updated. <laughs> it's no longer full black. Like he's getting closer. He's evolving. He's getting closer <laughs> to having the gold plated armor that that Nies has got on right now as we're in game number two. Rika started off with a game win or oh, with a lead once again, but Nies had that game win in, uh, in game number one. I wonder if Nies, he's dittoing Rika with Mordex. Do you think that he'll do the same against Rain if he wins this and then go Val versus Val? Like, is he just, just matching everybody's energy? With I mean, the he, does ha he does have <gasps> all of no, his power. Why did he go what? down there? Re okay, so Rika goes down there to get hit by the neutral sig. That's the only way that Nies could have come back. He does end up getting the knockout, um, but he did not need to go down there. That stock no. was finished. And by and because uh, Nies ends up getting the hit, you get the chase dodge back. He chase dodges straight up, drifts to the stage, was able to live a little bit longer, but then Rika was just ready to hit him for recovery. And now he's taking a huge lead here in game two. And he's continuing to extend it. Oh no, Nies finally clapping back a little bit here. Ooh, 
Whiffing on the signature, Rika not being able to get himself in a good position to punish it though. But now Ooh. we're seeing it like we saw the sweat beams out. He don't have that. He don't have it. Oh, and he gets the nair, the nair right at the edge of the stage. These uses oh. the gravity cancel neutral stick and. Rika with the peace of mind to be able to delay the ground pound yeah. for that. I, I did not, like, I feel like any other player would have gotten caught by the claws halfway down on the ground pound, and he just waited to be absolutely certain there. Covers the dodge, covers the gravity cancel, and now he's up a stock to one. Um, really well played here in game two. Yeah, definitely not as close as what we saw in game number one. Arika doing a fantastic job against knees here. Oh, with in neutral. Oh, he tried to get the hard read. It couldn't quite get it. Nair into Dare, but the Dare missed, but he's continuing to keep, um, to go keep out control. There. Oh. Recovery side it, it didn't knock. It didn't knock out, and he actually dodges above the second side stick there. Knees was hoping that was going to be that's the, crazy. The, the, I mean, that maneuver was like the comeback that's maneuver, That's crazy. Right? And now they're fighting off towards the top of the stage. Rika gets that's the it. side air. I think Knees that's is it. getting D-like ground pounded, <laughs> and Rika sweats off to the right side of the stage. Two stocks, Knees in game number two, and we're going into game three. All right. I I'll, mean, if, if that side stick hits, I think Knees clutches and wins the game. And I think because the side stick didn't knock out, he was just kind of like, oh, all right, I tried. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I'll, I'll, go, I'll go to the next one. Like this, this happening, that's pretty crazy. And then Rika just goes, nah, side light recovery. Oh, man. No, that is a very stark contrast from what we saw in game number one. Rika just nasty on the Mordex. Great ground pound there, yes. too. Really well played. I'm excited for game number three here. So knees with a game on the board. Rika, however, with the momentum going into game three. Let's see how game two, uh, uh, game three plays out. Oh. Nice job with that pivot dare. Looks like we're just picking up where we left off in game number two, to be perfectly honest. Rika taking complete control in the opening seconds of this game. Okay. Getting back, staying out of the way of knees. Put some more damage out. Oh, he, does he want the scythe? Oh, he's looking for a weapon. Knees <laughs> is not letting him have it, though. Rika, okay, dash four, dash back, pick up recovery. Goes all the way out there for gravity cancel downlight. Knees no. still sweating. Okay, he does jump and touch the stage. I wasn't sure if he knew how many resources they had left back. Um, now as I'm off the side of the stage, good jump. Both players seem to be covering the ledge, mm -hmm. and they're just recovering high, and I'm wondering who's going to adapt to that sooner. I'm, I'm, Because they keep going out like down light, side sigs, they're just going over their heads. Gauntlet recovery is great for that, but scythe, yeah, have to go for like gravity cancel and yeah. light or something. Like there's, it's just not as easy. And then neutral sig, isn't going to get you those early knockouts as well as a side sig is going to. All right, now we got Battle of the Scythe here. He's a scythe is just so much flashier. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, that's the same weapon? It's like, oh, no, it is. They do. It does the same amount of damage. <laughs> oh, missing on the side light. Right there to back it up, Whoa. though, and going to confirm off the recovery. Really early knockout. Yeah, we are all tied up. Okay, okay. I was a little worried that after we saw last game, Knees was going to kind of fall off and he was going to uh -huh. lose that momentum and that Rika was just going to continue to uh, put the pressure on. But we're seeing Knees kind of pull himself back together. A little rally here yeah. and very close to taking the lead. Yeah, every match that we've got moving forward from now on is a qualifier match for Bamiya. <laughs> like that's, like, Bamiya's looking at this and going, all so, right, so e weird. Each, each Knees loss is one step closer to Bamiya making it to the Royale. And Knees has to win the tournament, he, he, no less. So Rika already making that really difficult for yeah. him, going up two stocks to one. If Rika wins this, it's going to be two to one on the score line. Knees can't drop a game after that. Let's see if Knees can bring it back. Yeah, there's a lot riding for Knees right here. Oh. And it is not without. Oh. Nair, Ser, Nair, Ser, weapon throw, pickup goes with that down sig. Rika, what is going on? Oh. Knees, throwing that out there, getting punished off the neutral sig. Ooh, down uh, air. Rika is just, he's just turned up, man. He is completely. Okay, what was that down sig, Knees? What was that down sig? What are we going to send him? Desperation at this Dare, point, I weapon think. weapon throw, no dodge. Rika doesn't go for the down sig. I thought he was going to go for unarmed down sig there. Gravity cancel, do that recovery. Okay, Knees, let's see the perfect zero to knockout. On site. He knows it. He goes to the site. He's yeah. not going to do the gauntlets. Bring him off stage. I mean, and it's light air, possible. Light air. Okay, no dodge. Knees tries to catch the landing, but unarmed oh, air no. sends him flying. Scythe is the best thing for Knees yeah, right now, it. except that's like maybe the one move that knocks out grounded besides downlight. Okay, well, <sighs> Rick is now brought to match point. Yeah, and Knees needs two in a row to make something happen here. He's going to be on his tournament game. And that would mean that Rika would move forward to take on Rain in the elimination finals. Yeah, and that would secure Bamiya the Royale and possibly, possibly the tournament. Because so, after seeing Bamiya versus Rain, I guess I guess like at this point I'd say Rika has a better chance of upsetting Bamiya than Rain does. Yeah. Um, 
But I don't know. We have to see what the result of this match is going to so be. So if Nies loses this game, Bamya qualifies for the Royale. Correct. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. No, in order to stop Bamya from qualifying, Nies has to win. Nies can't oh, get second. Oh, he has to win the whole game. He has okay, to win okay, okay, the okay. whole tournament. So Nies can't get second. He's got to double eliminate Bamya in grants in I, order to qualify. Man, I don't, I don't want to curse nobody, but I think Bamya's going to the Royale. Bamya could be going to the Royale, <laughs> or Nies brings us to a, a, a really close game five, barely wins, and then upsets Rain. Like it's, it's still there. The possibility is still there. I, I do like this though, because no matter what happens in the rest of EU today, it's going to be fire. What is Nies bringing out for game four? Okay, so elimination point. He brings out four, Hammer and Orb. Orb's still doing well. Hammer did get a little bit of power taken out of its Downlight and Dare mm. in the most recent balance patch, um, but it's still a powerful Three, two, weapon, one, and Orb has definitely been very popular too. Just seeing Nies bring out four is interesting. Yeah, All right, here we go. That is a very interesting pick. Uh, I'm trying to put my head around it, honestly. He's conceded the Mordex did Odorica, though. So let's, let's, uh, oh, oh no. okay. Already. Reversal. Uh, uh, yeah. But he gets nared, grabs him on the ground. No, went for the jump that time, and Nee's actually recovered low. Na Downstick's going to catch him, and Nee's flying to the right side of the stage. Rico avoids. Okay, gets one nair. Nee's low on jumps. Gets hit by the recovery. I think that's going to be it, right? The he got dodged. That's the, it. The lights are getting very, very dim. <laughs> it is. Yeah. It is, uh, it is not looking good for our boy Nee's here. But he has been playing a long time. He does have the experience, and he can bring this back. We're going to have to see something come out of that Thor, though. But so far, it recovery, has been the pounds. Rika show. Okay. Stomps air. Stomps air. Can get the recovery here. That would be huge. Goes for the stop on the weapon instead. Side air was going to continue to edge guard him here. Stop side air. But the stop was too low because he, he ended up dashing with mm. it. So it dipped him lower. And now Rika's getting a ton of extra damage. Sarah to the side of the stage. Weapon throw. Pick up. Goes for the recovery. Doesn't even need it. He does need it. Side air hits again. How much damage does these need before Rika goes down, dodges the down air, but took so much damage just to be able to make the game even on stocks. Rika got so much extra credit off of that stock, put him in a very good position. Nizo kind of, kind of uh, making the hammer look pretty good here, though. It's scrappy to say the least. He's getting a lot of hits in, but he's not. He doesn't have that like um, that precision that like kind of brings to yeah. the table where it's like, okay, it's six hits and then knockout. It's more like 18 hits and then like an edge guard. <laughs> it's, it's weird um, seeing Hammer being played that way. Rika, however, one good hit away. Is the neutral light going to do it? No. Gauntlet neutral light, not that powerful. Can oh, these make the land? Oh. <gasps> what the? What? That's just a misinput. I know. That's but brutal to have. How, that's oh. brutal. That's brutal at this point of the game. Oh, All right, no. Nice. That's so unfortunate. So I mean, he was, he was damaged enough to where it was like one hit anyways. Um, but it is very unfortunate. Let's see if he gets the edge guard here. Sidelight misses. Nope. Rika gets end light. Nair, Sayer, Nair, Sayer again. Rika getting that combo so much on knees, and knees just taking so much damage. Nair, neutral light, side air. I think this is going to be it for Nees' run. Yeah, the, the lights are no longer dim. They are pretty much out for knees at this point. That oh. Sayer might do it. He didn't have a whole Weapon lot throw. of options. He don't have it. Oh, the, oh, the signature kit like from Thor misses. is going to save his stock. Gravity cancel neutral sig, still a powerful recovery option, but uh, Nies has got to... <laughs> he's, 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 he's just... Yeah, he's, 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 he's checked out. Okay. All right, what do we got? Rika looking for the flashy finisher, which might be just unarmed neutralite. Uh, what is it? Does Down Nies, Does Nies let him hit the clip? Gravity cancel neutral signature? I don't think so. I think, no, I, I think that's it. That's yeah. good. <laughs> Rika winning over Nies, three to one, knocking Nies out at fourth. And congratulations to Bamia before the trial is even over for qualifying for the season royale in that fourth spot. That's going to make a godly Munir reign in Bamia. That's crazy. That's going to be here in Atlanta, Georgia next month in October. Yes.